You guys were up 11 with like, I don't know, early in the second half and, you know, they went on a run from there. It was just back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. What was it about tonight that made it difficult maybe for you guys to close out? Uh, really, we, I mean, when we pulled away with 11, you know, they came back, you know, it's a game of runs anyways, but that's when we should have put our neck, our foot on our throat, but yeah, we didn't do that. And, you know, coach told us at halftime when he, when it gets to the 10 minute mark in the second half, it's gonna be anybody's game, and the crowd's gonna get into it. So that's we just we messed up on that. I know the game that. just ended, but his message to you guys after the game, what did he say? Uh, we gotta come. We gotta be better on the road. You know, this our what fourth time we lost on the road. We just gotta come back, come come ready to play, and we gotta rebound, close out late game situation, get the rebound. We gotta make free throws, but we can we can we can get through that throughout and this la week. La Hunter, lastly, how frustrating is this one? Uh, yeah, no, it's, it's pretty frustrating um, when you're up 11. Um, I just think, you know, I got I got to do more for my team out there. Um, I feel like I let them down today. Anyone else? Got a microphone right here. Shay, pass it over. Hunter, when you said you feel like you let the team down, what exactly do you mean by that? Uh, just a couple of plays, you know, tipping it in for their for their team. Um, I mean, you know, when you're literally giving them two points. Uh, when we cut it to two and I ran him over, um, I really don't understand how that can be a foul, but I can't, I guess, give the defender any contact on a screen. But I guess I got to run around the screen. Um, but just making those type of plays when uh, the game is close, I, I can't do. Dewan, what, what were the thoughts going into overtime? You guys had to kind of force OT and, and sure. got a reset there. Thought we had it. Remember two years ago, we came back in overtime. You know, I, I've been there, coach been there before, and I just thought we had the game. But, you know, they they going to compete too. You know, they was on a losing streak on four, and we, we were KU, and we knew they was going to bring it. So we just got to be better on the road. Coach keeps talking about the consistency for this team. I mean, played a great game Saturday, and then two days later, I, I don't want you to use excuses, obviously, but mm -hmm. Gassed out there tonight. No, nah, ain't no excuses. We just got to take care of business. You know, we should have won that game, and all the you know all the credit goes to them. They came out and did what they're supposed to do. But you know, we got to be better on the road, though. And defense and late in the clock. Defense too, and late game rebounding too. So sure. yeah. Juan, how much do you think foul trouble played a role, especially at the end of regulation into overtime? Uh, I mean, that played a big a big role. But you know, when we go. Go on a road, it's, it's always going to be like that. So we just got to play smarter and defend and guard our man. But yeah, like I said, it's always going to be like that when we go on the road. So something we're used to. So we just got to be smarter. Uh, Dwan, you do always get everybody's best game on the road. But K State, do you think maybe they amp it up a little bit extra for you guys? Uh, yeah, always. You know, this is the, one of the biggest rivalry in college basketball. And, you know, they like I said, they was on a, on a losing streak. So this is their chance to get back on a winning track, and you know that's what they and they did that. So we just gotta, like I said, come back and be better, and get better this whole week and get ready for Baylor. So anything else? It, minutes has been a, a conversation all year. How difficult is it to play heavy minutes in, in an overtime game in this environment? I mean, you guys just played big minutes the other day too. Is that factoring in? It has been all year. Uh, I mean, to me, for me, uh, I played the whole game last year, so yeah. there, there is no excuses. I, I just got to be better for my team and get the W, so. Hunter, do those minutes take a toll in a game like this that goes to overtime, short rest, all that stuff? No. Gary? Juan, I didn't see this, but somebody was saying that on your three-pointer, one of the coaches might have clapped in your face. Did anything like that happen? Uh, I'm just going by what somebody uh, said. I don't know. I, didn't, I don't think about it. I, don't, I didn't see that, so I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. So. Okay, thanks. Uh, they had, did a great job of kind of defending Johnny. What did they do differently than some of the other teams have done uh, in this game? Um, I think he missed a couple mm. open shots, but I think he got that one blocked at the end of the game. But I feel like he just missed them. I don't think they really did anything. I think he just, you know, shooters going to struggle some games. And, you know, I think that's, he just had that today. So, Yeah, I feel like they were um, quicker with their closeouts with them. Um, I think that's, you know, like Coach said, 
earlier, <clears throat> they're gonna they're gonna adjust how how they guard him now, and I think teams are realizing that he's a really good catch and shoot guy. So I think you know as a team we gotta try to adjust to that because um, you know he's so talented that he's more than just a spot up shooter. So we can we gotta be able to exploit. Uh, you know his talents out there. When you say adjust, what it, what exactly does that mean? Like, how can you change up uh, what you guys are doing out there? Using a shot fake. Mm -hmm. Hunter, you've obviously played in a lot of rivalries from back to time at Michigan, and even this year against Missouri. Where did this one, whether that's the atmosphere or just the fight on the court, stack up? Uh, it, was, it was it was good. It was it was a fun um, atmosphere. Um, you can tell that there's definitely some some disdain uh, between the universities, and so I feel like it was a great environment, and that made for a great game. And unfortunately, we just uh, came up short. All right, thanks, boss. Thanks, Rock Chalk.